Welcome to the Pivot Point workshop video on asking for it. So what does it mean to ask for it? Well, as I've defined in Pivot Point, there's a difference between wanting to do something and saying, I will do something. So let's think about that difference. Think of a time when you said, I want to do this versus a time when you said, I will do this. There's a key difference here. <clears throat> wanting or trying to do something is completely different as committing to the will mentality of making it happen. As humans and as women, our brains are wired to complete things that we commit to by saying I will. Our career game plan needs to be constructed with intentional communication with positive statements around I will do this. It's all about replacing our fears with those positive affirmations. Saying I am a respected and highly sought after fill in the blank is so different than saying I want to be a highly respected and sought after fill in the blank. Alternatively, a great positive affirmation also centers on communication around I will achieve fill in the blank. These We'll learn how to craft these types of statements that are so powerful to intentionally communicate in our ask for it communications. So what are some tools to ask for it? As with all of our career game plan strategies, we have three key principles that we'll use to guide us through the strategy. The first one's about proactive preparation. We really want to be armed with all of the data and background information around anyone on our career game plan team or the goals that we want to accomplish with our pivot line statement. We really, really want to know everything we need to know about that before we sit down and communicate with those that can help us get there. Thinking about our career game plan team from the previous strategy, it's all about active listening when we're with these folks. Time is finite as we discussed and being with the people that will help us achieve our plan in Using and leveraging that information is critical. <clears throat> so when we sit down and have a conversation with them, most of it's going to be us listening to them. The mentor that's been there before, feverishly take notes and, know that, and take away as much information as you can in the finite time that we have. A suggested good conversation is when we listen more than we talk. I know, seems kind of uh, different, doesn't it? And then intentional communication. This is all around being very clear about what our objectives are, which the career game plan template helps so much to do, and being very crisp in our next steps and keeping people in the loop on the progress that we make on our career game plan. When we've got folks in our corner, we gotta keep them up to date with what we're doing. They wanna know, they've invested their time in us. So really that's key for asking for it. So back to our career game plan team from our previous strategy. Think about that celebrator. Have you figured out who that is yet? What about the advisor, the mentor who's been there before, the coach who promotes self-discovery, the challenger that really cares about us and wants to help us be better? All of these people will help and how they'll best help is when we ask for it through being very clear on what our purpose is. We find folks that have aligned goals to us, have similar competencies that we're working on building, those skills and behaviors that we want to model from those that we focus on and spend our time with, and align on common actions. You know, it's said that the top five people that we spend most of our time with really do have the biggest impact on who we are. Um, and we tend to model and mirror those we spend time with. Think about this team. That, that, that's who you want to model and mirror. And it's all about being very clear when we meet with them and asking for it through purpose, goals, competencies, and actions. As with all of our career game plan strategies, please do go online and find more resources, including videos, workshops, career game plan templates, and workbooks to help you build your winning career game plan. It's all available at helpyourteamgrow.com. There you can schedule time with me, sign up for our, worksho our workshops, as well as our newsletter communication community. So I look forward to uh, connecting with you and seeing you in January.